some boards sir reading up all right let's get back We are in homies. Okay. Let them do their own. Oh man, we have a gun here, why are we? What kind of weapons we got? Singles EMP rocket. Photon compression laser. <laughs> Mag beam. Magna beam. Fire beam. Howitzer. Cannon. Hanging cannon. Huh. Artillery. This looks like they have more experience than I do.
Oh, we got. He's in the Mantium, right? There we are. He's just metal. Holy crap. Oh my god. Oh, there's Adamantium. There's also area aluminum, right? Let's drop the cores. May not go that well. Mind you, I, I haven't really done this successfully on this map. holding it up. I got something back there. Tell me where this stuff is. I was holding it up back there. Yeah, we got these down here. That worked. Come on. Jeez, come on. Well, it's there now.
All right, that core is dropped. This is home now. Let's get this stuff here. Cores are fine now. Yeah, okay. Oh, let's let's get back there. This just seems like really chaotic. Low time compression lasers, maybe? Yeah. It just feels like I'd like to use an adamantium here. here. Holy shit, that's a lot of metal. I don't think I have enough of that. This is not that fun is the problem here. You know? That is the problem I have here.
Um, this guy needs some outcropping protection. Alright, so I said the orange the yellow ones were the ones for Hell, I don't know. This is just too much. You know? Trying to get through these doors. All right. I knew what these were. All right, these are more. All right, so the red ones trade something out. Yeah. Okay. Apparently, we won. That's so much fun. Oh, so much fun. Yeah.
Very similar build. He doesn't have a sniffer. Back there, there we go. Wager, he's already put another one in there. <coughs> Cannot seem to get that. In time. Oops, I reloaded the wrong one. Okay. No, I'm seeing that. Thank you. 
Oh, great. There's Now we don't start with any thing really. Economy wise. Technology employer. I am still going missiles though. Ah, <laughs> uh, this may be too close. I mean, this is gonna hit. He doesn't know this is gonna be coming like this though. We need the other up here. I can delete this anyway once I'm done with it. You got me, kid. Put it there. And put it there. Damn it. right there. Where it's got to be placed. I, I think I can do about it. Why isn't the other one firing? Shoot. Oh, it is this.
Well, I have to place the technology somewhere. And the only place I could really put it is over here. That guy, goodbye. And go after his uh, turbines next. Ship is on fire, kid. Kind of a bitch. Oh. Might be able to get through there. Why are. Okay. Let's go to the second one. He's AFK. Or he got disconnected. Sucks, bro.
I think I'm going to switch over to RimWorld. Man, I haven't played that game in a while. Such a great game. Interesting library. I don't have stuff to play, really. Did everything in end zone already. I can't play takes two without a partner. Just a dead guy to put that to death. Be done. Breath Heads, that was a cool game. Finish that. That looks okay. Finish skull on just skull. No other upgrades. Just skull. Basic head. Done that. You know, safety was okay. Finish cyberpunk. Blah, blah, blah. Um, this is still an early accent. Right? Whoa, whoa, whoa. They actually released it? There wasn't much there. Go take a look at um oh that was 2020 yeah I've played it since then I think I did finish this thing yeah there wasn't much to this game either let's find Rimworld A long time since I played Rim World. Let's launch it. Oh, you know, this has the greatest soundtrack for a game. So I think we'll be using this soundtrack. It's been a while since I checked this out. So. Let's see. I mean, it's been at least a year since I played it. A year and a half. So, we're going to do a new colony. And, uh, yep. As we are going to be one guy. To start the base out with. And it's been a while. Um, thank you, Brutality. Uh, but we are going to... Uh, do I have my bots installed still? Let's see what bots I have. Okay. Uh, 
I have some of these mods that need to be must be loaded for more. harmony mod. Um, smart speed lets you speed up the game. You prepare carefully mod is what I want. Need hugs library. Yeah, we're not gonna use that. Or reunion. Uh, Blueprints was really useful and the allowed tool. I remember that. And we can use quality building to automate something. But nothing that's going to really change the uh, gameplay at all. Okay, so we're going to restart the game. Because we really very much want to be careful. Alright. It has been ages since I played. I had the most epic game when they changed the patch over. Okay. So, Naked Brutality. And I'm going to. Starting People 1. Where we're going to make it. Um, naked. Yeah, always 100%. Drop out's fine. We're going to choose the one. We're just going to make our dude. And new tribe. We're going tribal. And we're definitely going um, Randy Random. And we're going to go with the. Is this? Is it? Settings going to be unfair. I haven't seen this before. Uh, definitely, um, I'm in the mode. We're not reloading. Is there a custom setting? Okay, yeah, we want the custom setting. We want um, losing input is fun, but we want custom. We want red scale, but 500%, I guess. Predators hunt humans, sure, during weather. I don't I haven't seen these before. Okay, well we're just gonna go with uh, losing is fun. I'll go with that. And I would go fifty percent here. This all seems normal. Let's see kind of world we get. We want a desert with uh, whatever the main building material is and marble. Okay, so we're going to go with desert. We know we want extreme desert. That's what we wanted. This will kill us. It's been, like I said, it's been a while since I played this, so. Not sure how we're going to do. I'd like to be away from Pyrus initially. Out here looks pretty decent. Let's see what is. Um, we want the map size to be a, big, a little bit bigger, not too large. about that. Okay. Terrain. Granite, limestone, and marble. Want sandstone and marble is what we want. There's marble sand. We want sandstone to be the main one. Wait, granite. Oh, marble and sandstone, that's pretty good. Uh, what's the temperature? Okay, we want it... We want it where it's always hot, though. We want it to be able to kill us, basically. That's what we want. There we go. Alright, there, there. That's hot enough to kill us. The Hadamore Desert. 
Wait, that's, that's just desert. That's not extreme desert. It's not extreme desert. That was... You're gonna make this hard, right? Seems like the only extreme desert. Oh, that's, uh, maybe that is. Yeah, there's gonna, there's one that can kill us. Who would be on this? Very much able to kill us. So let's pick a good spot. That seems decent. What sandstone and mar marble specifically? Um, I'd like to stay away from the coast though. Marble, granite, and sandstone would be really good though, but being against the coast is got its own share of problems. I'm not a big stickler for having granite. Oh, actually, granite's pretty good. Now I think about it. Well, I guess I would like to have all those three. That this does have all three of them, but the sandstone's the weaker one. I kind of want it first. I'd rather not have mountains. There we go. That's perfect. It's a grandstone marble year round. Very very hot. Kill us. All right. Okay. Now we need to make our dude, and we're gonna he's prepared carefully. We're gonna have one guy the entire run. Name's gonna be. Well, first of all, he's gonna be a guy. And we'll put his age around 32. Actually, we'll put his chronological age 400, whatever. He's a space pirate. Next story. Um. We are doing tribal, but basically didn't know anything. Uh, hold on. For now, we just want one able-bodied. Um, things we're gonna give him is psycho, absolutely. Psycho, psychopath. Yep. Uh, we're gonna give him uh, jogger. That's very important. And usually give him industrious or hard work. This is about the three that I usually have. Uh, Doctors is pretty good too. Like I said, it's been a long time since I played this, but I might just have Jogger and Psychopath. Uh, our backstory is there's two backstories I really like or used to like. One of them, uh, Space Pirate is one of them. Pirate Captain, the other. I think Pirate Captain gives me the stats I really like. Uh. Oh, that's adult. Yeah, never mind. One sec, we'll go with Pirate Captain first. Space Pirate gives you, or, or Spaceship Raider also. That's the other one. Space Raider is good. Let's take mission. You basically want a little bit of shooting, doctor, and some research. You know, Space Raider was good. Shooting, melee, social. Because he needs to be able to talk with other people. Shooting, melee was also pretty good. Um, this one's really good. Shooting, melee, and social. Uh, there's also the Raider Captain. Space Captain or Space Raider? I can't remember. Space Pirate or Space Raider? Uh, there's a better one than this. I know there is. There's some new ones in here I haven't seen before. 
Let's go through them. Ace fighter pilot. Mm -hmm. No, we really do need, need mining. Uh -huh. We basically want shooting, social, and uh, cooking, I think. I never really want to be in, in melee. I think there is one with some bonus to digging or something. Something captain. There's crime lord too. Getting melee social intellectual. Uh, but you get you lose all doctoring art. You lose doctoring and cleaning though. You can't. You can't not have doctoring. <laughs> mm. Destroyer general. Hauling is is great and cleaning is important too. Especially since we only have one guy, he has to do everything. Mm -hmm. Oh, construction support, too. But if we can't shoot anything early, we're going to die. Because we can't get any food, we have to build a shelter. And we need the social aspect. I remember there's something captain. Oh, I can have filters, that's right. We want, um... Shooting. We want... Social, and we want uh, doctoring. I think. What do we have now? Uh, we don't really need melee, honestly. Oops. So these are all the ones with shooting and social. Because we basically want him to be able to sweet talk anything. Base trafficker. No. And we have to make sure there's no disabled work tanks. Okay. Here we go. Uh Caravaneer was was pretty good too. But we want him to be like a, a space pirate that that dropped on the planet. Doesn't know anything. Oh, we can have actually we can have uh art disabled. That's true. We can have art disabled. I forgot about that. Uh, we want shooting plus five, though. Okay. King of Pirates. I think that was another one. Yeah, that one disabled cooking, though, which is a bit of a problem. I think this might be um, doctoring disabled now. There it is. Pirate Captain. Shooting melee social. Versus Space Raider, which is shooting 8, melee 3, social 5. I'm not sure which one I like better. Maybe less in the melee. I think the Space Raider is probably a little better. Disgrace officer. This one's actually not bad either, shooting social. Didn't give you any negatives. Okay. And, uh, Child... Could was we wanted something with digging. I think it's Cave Child, honestly. Kind of wanted something with mining. Uh, Cave World Tunneler. Oh, uh, they can't do anything that way. Never mind. Um, Sig Mining plus three and construction. Orphan of War, I think. Visiting sick people. Just no. We need him to be a warpin too. Ah, oh, this one. Art disabled. Labor can't work. Can't do art, but that's fine, because we don't care about art. <laughs> no bearing on what we're doing here. Yeah, so he might go psychopath a little bit. Alright, let's exit his skills out. We want him to be a jack of all trades. So we give him pretty much uh, medic, social, intellectual. Um, we will be doing some planting. Cooking, definitely mining, construction, social shooting. Shooting is his main skills. Medical, social. Do I have any more characters? Oh, we're limiting ourselves on points to, to whatever the normal would be. Uh, about I think it's eighteen hundred, right? Is it normal? Hold on. Um, let me go ahead and. 
set this to normal. How many characters points would we normally get? That's what I want to know. Whatever character points we would normally get, we want to use. So this has 1,958 points. So we get to spend 1,958 points. Okay. Oh, we're going to make his age again. About 32. This could be anything. 327. Looks great. Um, let's just randomize it up here. Doesn't look like a scary pirate to me. There you go. That looks fine. Okay. We're going to the way we went. We were taking Orphan of War. Yep. And we're going to take Space Raider. Here. And we're going to add Psychopath. Because we, we, we spend points when we take these, so it's not like it's nothing. And Psychopath, we wanted... Um, industrious. And we wanted... Uh, su Supermune's also not so bad. But we don't have to worry about that so much here. What were we taking? Dogger is like beyond important. And we were going to take Industrious. Okay. And then we were going to give him uh, he's a great shooter. Uh, medical and intellectual or the things we need. Like he can do social. Anyway. Oh, warning disabled. No, no. Can't have that. What's the only one we had? We wanted um bonus to mining. We wanted bonus to construction, right? Okay, so labor camp orphan, that's it. Okay. I'm like, uh, social is super, super duper important for him. Okay. So, we have about 400 points left. Uh, we need to get some in crafting, or else we won't be able to make bow like, points. Uh, in getting these first points in this uh, is, like, so worthwhile. We have a little bit more to spend. I would give him a passion for that. I have to go to foreign crafting three. A little bit more to spend. Shooting's fine. Direction is fine. Um, another call collection. Give me point animals just in case. All right, and there's our points. Well, we're going a little bit over. Okay, back. Okay, so there's all the points we had originally. If we, give, if we give ourselves impairments, we get more points. But I actually think that's too many points. Maybe we should probably dial it back a little bit. Two crafting, two points, two cooking, two mining, three uh, Yeah, give ourselves a name. It's a little bit less. And. Just there. The pirate. Also known as Barracuda. No real past. No real future. And no other friends. Alright. See if I can remember. Oh, right, let's check his equipment. Should be nothing. Um, we're removing all of his equipment. Okay. He's completely naked. 
Yeah, one thing, one other thing. I think we need to make sure we're tribal, right? Oh, I still have the presets here. What are my other presets? It's termite. Basket. <gasps> it's my original one. And this has same this is the exact same I just made. <laughs> well, that's good to know. At least is it? Oh wait, hold on. Alright, well, that is the one I made, never mind. There's there's my original one. Tough Ningle and Sanguine. I took Abandoned Child and Hearth Tender. Oh, this is just full on primal. Huh. There's no shooting there. And under 15 point. Hmm. Interesting. Um, yeah, one sec. I want to make sure that we're on tribal here. Okay, so let's just go with our preset that we had here. And we're going to make sure that his technology is primal, is uh, primal though. I think we already set that, right? I think we did. I'm going to nail their points where we'll be okay. All right. Let's head down. See if we can survive. It has been a long time since I did this, so. Wait for him to respond. Okay, I can pause it there. Let's take a look around. Some cactuses over here. First things first. We need to get food. Okay, so we're gonna find out where we're gonna be situated. So I like to be around where the vents are. Got some uh compact machinery and iron steel. Stuff that we can cannibalize over here. Here. The lizard over here. That's good. Gotta get some animals before they leave. We gotta go ahead and get to make a bow. So this we are going to wood. Okay, it's coming back to me. So getting a weapon up is our number one priority. We have, a, we have a tree there. We have a cactus there. It's not enough wood, though. Turn off Spotify for now. We open for crafting spot. I do miss this music a lot. We could make a club. Do we have enough for a war bow? And we do have marble here to make a club with. Of course, we could also make it out of sandstone. Alright, let's make a little. Let's not worry about cutting this down for now then. I'm gonna make a club or something. We gotta get food. We need to make a uh, stockpile zone right here. What we'll do is we're gonna get the sandstone. All right, let's do that. Things we need right now are food and shelter, or we will die. Uh, 
Uh, why are you not holder? Oh, wait. That's right. We need a, um, a waste there in stockpile zone. Oh, we can't use that, can we? We need a dumping stockpile zone there. allow him to bring that over there, right? What does he need to make the club? Oh yeah, he can use silver or steel or stone block. Yeah. This is stone blocks chunks, isn't it? Um, what I can do is, a new plan, let's uh, delete this stuff for now, and we're going to go over where we can actually get blocks. Okay, um, where is the iguana? One there, and there is one, hold on, let's see, animals, okay. no, not there, wildlife. Go. An iguana there. And there, right next to us. Okay, that's good. Go ahead and de deconstruct this stuff here. We'll go deconstruct this stuff. This will give us enough to make a club. And then we'll go ahead and put a dumping stockpile zone there. And a little stockpile zone here. We'll probably make this place over here into some sort of anything. Now he's going to get hot here really quick. And this is steel. That's cool. Okay, so we're also going to make a crafting zone here. Add the uh, make a club bill. Let's make a knife. I think the club is better. You should be able to make the club now with the steel. We're going to equip the steel club. And now we're going to go hunt the iguana. Because if we don't get any food, we're going to die. And this is a little risky when we do this, but if we don't do it, we just die. So. Uh, why are you not hunting? Alright, let's go kill him. I'll figure out why he didn't hunt later. We just need to get this corpse. Okay. And now we need to treat ourselves. We need to doctor him. Forgot how to do that. Oh, we gotta take him off draft. That's right. Hold on. Self tend is disabled. Okay, let's fix that. You definitely need to be self tending. We can die from this.
So we have something to eat now. We're going to go ahead and eat this now. We're going to kill another iguana. And we are sweaty. We're going to need to find some sort of shelter. All that back there. There's the other iguana. These iguanas are not going to be here very long. Next one. We do need to kill it. It might end up killing us, but. Alright, very good. Let's get up here. And I like the club because it stuns. And now we'll need to eat one of the iguana. He will not like eating raw iguana. But we don't have much of a choice. Okay, now we need to make shelter. Now he's full. Uh, now we need to make sure to shelter us. He's gonna die. So uh, structure gonna be wall. Since we have steel here, I'm gonna make a little steel room over here, not there. We have more wall over here, so we'll do it there. Do we have a little room right here? Right. Don't need much here, we just need that and store here. Alright, go ahead and build it. We should have enough steel for that thing. We might need to. Just if we do need to. Probably need to deconstruct part of the wall here. Maybe this one too. We need to change our priorities around too. Alright, Doctor is first. Um, clean is last. All craft first. Uh, construct is first also. It was cook basic needs. So now you should do this automatically. Taylor art craft. Uh, clean should be four. We you should automatically deconstruct that and then construct this. We only need nine, and we still need one more. One barracuda. So now he should be able to go inside. Well, at least we'll make a sleeping spot in there. Okay. Now he's going to go ahead and, and put this. Okay, that'll allow us to survive the night, the day, the cooler. Okay. 
Um, we need to build a sleeping spot. It's not comfortable, but it will keep us alive. Okay. So he should be getting cooler. It's 42 degrees Celsius inside. That's not Yeah, we might need to get a cooler. He might die here. You don't need like trees around though. Hey, what's where's his needs at right now? Should be nighttime too soon anyway. Okay, so we're gonna eat, wake up, and eat that. And the next thing we need to craft really is like a bow. Because the club is okay. It will kill us if we keep using it. Um, okay. We need to find the cactus. Cut all the cactus down. Okay, we also need to plant something to eat. Or else we're going to die. Zone, growing zone. There. Actually here. And we're just gonna plant um, rice. Because we can actually survive on just a little bit of rice we can grow here. We probably should have planted this before we went to sleep, but what am I gonna do? Okay. Now it's possible that he goes mental, but oh, we do need to get a cooler also. Not a lot I can do about that right now. He has initial heat stroke, which is not amazing. Temperature should be dropping at night. Okay. Alright, at least I'll be waking up now. Alright, brother. Time to get up. Oh, you're not doing bed rest. Yeah, you're not doing bed rest. So. Get to sew in the food first. Yeah, he possibly will actually break. That's okay. We got a couple of days left on this corpse too. That's okay. He'll eat pretty soon. If we don't get this growing, we, we die too. So. The other thing we're going to need to make is a some sort of recreation for him.
So I'll be making a steel hoopstone ring on here. Because we need to uh, reconstruct some things. And in all fairness, it should be fairly cool inside now. Or not. We need to make a cooler. Because we need to do that. And build another steel wall here and here. But hopefully it gets this hoopstone ring done. Yeah. So now we can avoid a metal break. It's pretty important that we, we get some sort of recreation in. And Barracuda is making the rest of the wall. He may go psycho. Let's hope he keeps it together. Okay, as long as we keep this mood up here, we should be okay. Uh, we have some food being made. When this gets to about half or so, we can actually harvest it. How much wood do we have? We need to make a cooler. Need 50 wood for that. No way we get that. Steel's not so great for not conducting heat. We're in a steel box. Yeah, we have heat stroke, it's not good. Minor heat stroke though, so maybe we'll be okay. Better if we were in a cave inside of here somewhere, I think. We might try to do that next. Alright, let's do this. Let's um dig into the steel here. And that'll give us something to use. We'll dig a little room in here. And that should help us keep out um, any uh, heat there. Alright, so I need mine. I need you to mine, bro. Or else you're going to die heat stroke. He needs food again. I think the other iguana might have gone. Nope. He's still there. Let's go get him. Just get through this without him going psycho. It'll be okay. Yeah, you need to haul that iguana, kid. You just need to, to eat it. All 
All right, let's drop it. Wait, no, 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 no. no just, just eat the iguana or you go crazy. If he doesn't eat and he goes psycho, we have a big problem. Okay. He is not happy, but what are we going to do? Let him rest. Okay, so now we have some food, though. There's rice. Alright, and nobody's going outside, so. We have a manhunter pack that came by? Wow. But it's probably bunnies, though. And I'm taking guinea pigs. At least this is something we can possibly deal with. I mean, that is food. Let's let him sleep, though. He has serious heat stroke. I'd let that cool down. I don't know he would yet. And we can't really do anything about it. So we we might be able to if we can get inside the cave. It's usually cool inside the this area. Probably should have done that initially, but like I said, I haven't played this in a long time. Hopefully they go away before he wakes up, because he cannot wait. And I didn't make any traps yet. It's kind of bad. Oh, I should have made some traps earlier. Well, on the flip side, they bring us food. That's a heat stroke. Still serious. Good. All right. So, wake him up. Oh, the fox took out one. They're fighting the fox. Cool. Good for us. The fox is actually hunting them. Cool. Awesome. That's good for us. Without a doubt. And this fox probably dies really soon. Alright, we need to uh, eat that right now. Ooh, he has Scaria. Hold on, no, we can't eat that. Interesting. I don't want to mess with it. I do want to build this, though. However, this fox may end up dead if he runs into one of our traps. Should get one trap up. Can we harvest this yet? I think I'm harvest a little wildlife. Just the fox there. Might have to risk killing this fox. He needs food bad. I 
I have to. I have to, I have to get some food. Well, at least we don't have any scars yet. Right, make sure we eat this guy now. Tend to Barracuda again. Yeah, we need that. This is a big problem. I am dead. I probably should have made this. Then again, I haven't played this in a long time. This was a good dry run, though. It's very, very difficult to survive in extreme desert. And actually getting into the sandstone area would be really good. It's possible we pull out of this in the night. Oh, he has food poisoning, that's why. Let's wait till it goes to minor. Okay. That's why he has food poisoning. We got 1.9 days left on this box. And this stuff is ready to harvest very, very soon. Not for a lot, but a little bit. Uh, oh. All right, he needs a little bit of rest. Back to mine. Oh, he's gonna make some crap. That's probably pretty good. Big guy. In all honesty. Alright, we don't just need one trip. I need him to mine this out so he has a place to sleep. Uh, all right, we got for wildlife. He's gonna hope that comes into play soon. Hey, 
it's only 27 degrees outside now. Man, a bed fit in the harvest plants. I didn't plan them when I got here. Hopefully we'll be okay. Always these. No, it's rotting. I want to get deeper in there. Steel door on here. I don't need to have a store because everyone. Indoors should be a little cooler. Yep, bad wander. There it is. His first mental break. Hopefully he doesn't die from it. I really should have planted this right when I got here. It needs to be at like 10 plus percent, I think, maybe. And I should check the um, zone, right? Growth zones. How do I know it's good? I can't remember which overlay. Oh, there we are. Right here. Yeah. That's <laughs> basically bad growing zone. Yeah, I definitely should have planned these when I got here. That's all right. All right. Nothing wrong with that one. Come on, Beard. Snap at it. I survived a little longer. The rice is done. Good to go. Get this one done, have a place to sleep. Spot up here. Kinda wanna get them farther in there. At least he's got the door there. Okay, so he's out of the break. If this stuff is ready to be hard, but then not. Oh, wait, there's wildlife here. Ooh, these things can't attack a dromedary without range weapon. I will just die. They will hit me really hard. I very much just need these to grow just a little bit more. Okay, this might be good actually. This is actually good for us. Because, worst case scenario, we can always eat them. Very good, it might have to do some things that he's not used to. Let him sleep as long as he can. 
This is why I made the steel trap, though. He will probably have a psychotic break from this. And okay. Hey, he's got first aid. Let's see if he got hurt really bad. Not too bad. See, so we don't really have to defend this one right now. We need to, uh. Oh, we need to strip her. We need to, uh, take her stuff. I know it's painted, but better than being nude. And then we need to eat her. Right. Uh, he needs food. He is starving very badly. And she has food. So. Sure. Alright, you can stop. Stop that. Just stop. Alright, get back to digging there, Barracuda. And we want to haul this away. But we're going to basically move our zones over there. Okay. And yeah, he will probably have a psychotic break from that. But he's in catharsis right now. He did not like eating a corpse, though. Uh, I'm gonna then out of the door close it because we can we can we should be able to make it somewhat cooler in here. All right, gonna tend to his wounds, and we don't need this here. Wouldn't mind using that, but we have a little bit of time. And it's looking like the rice is going to come in fairly quickly. I don't want him sleeping here. I do want him sleeping in here now. So, farther back the better. Put another stockpile zone outside. Put one in here. Nothing fresh in there. No foods. Just raw resources. Good. Rotten thing. I think it's cold enough outside, it doesn't matter anyway. But this will hold its temperature inside here a little bit better. The farther back we go, the better it'll be. You can avoid getting heat stroke with him. Alright, he needs food again. Well. Oh, I've already done it once. See how bad that affected him. Yeah. No. Still did not like it. Oh well. What are you going to do, right? Okay, so. Yeah, that's fine. We're going into days, no problem. As long as we don't run into anything that will kill us, we'll be okay. So, let's go ahead and make. A steel trap over here, so we have a little bit of protection when he comes out of this day. And maybe another steel trap. So that he has some way to defend himself. Because we don't need wood. 
Alright, so here's a slaver. Um, if we get too weak, I think they slave us. So. We're in a sad wander. Oh, that's actually pretty good for us. This Scaria stuff is terrible, though. We can't use any of these for food. Alright, so while he is in a daze, um, there are a lot of people here. So they will end up attacking the geese. Yeah. So we're going to get lucky there. Bang. And eventually we'll get done with this sad wander here. At least we ate before he did that. We won't die when it comes out of this. Hey, these are harvestable. We're going to have something to consume. What's he doing on health? Hmm. Oh, fan of that. I think I remember what I did before. I think I would take steel and I would go trade it over somewhere else. Yeah. I don't think I ever tried to just survive on my own like this. Well, looks like he is not psychotic anymore and he's happy to eat eat hyena again. So hell no 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 dromedaries. Oh, we need to harvest them before they eat it all. You gotta, you gotta harvest stuff now. Oh, you're still in a daze. Never mind. Oh, here goes our food. If they eat it all. They are gonna eat it all. Nope. First things first. I didn't cut the plants, please. Your number one priority now. Now we need to haul all this stuff. All plus. Damn dromedaries. Alright, so the dromedaries are done there for now. We have a little bit of food stored up. It's not a lot, but it's something. And I would like to get this squirreled away somewhere. And I don't want any steel in this zone. I got a little bit of food. That dromedary is really wrecked me. What we can do is we can mine a bunch of steel. And then go trade. Which is probably what we're going to have to do. We do need to... Um, assign grow. Be super important. Maybe the dromedaries will 
get themselves on a spike on a steel trap. That'll be great. Here we have a little bit of, oh, we're out of rice. So let's just get this done. All right, that should be enough. Okay. So the nearest town is super far away. Nice. If I wanted to go there, how long would it be? They will buy steel. It looks like it's a distance away. Do I need to right click it? Yep. 1.76 days. So, he's already rotting. Is there any wildlife here? Just the dromedaries. I think that's the play. He can survive a couple days without food. Let's, let's. Okay. I know it's a bit of ways away, but what are we going to do? Caravan. There. Yep. I bring him and all the steel. And the steel club. I don't have a lot to bring though yet. I don't think we can do that yet. We have to mine some more first. Maybe hopefully something comes in. Cannot attack the dromedaries. So they'll go all attack. We don't have a bow. We're kind of SOL there. Okay, so he's fully healed anyway. I think we still do that. I think we form caravan. Go here. It might be 1.6 days, but he is healed now. Bring all the steel. And the steel club. Ooh, we're, we are at the mass for that. Okay. That's not bad. Actually, I have enough. Oh. Steel club's worth more. Clean 11.8 house per day. Okay. I'm aware he'll become hungry very carefully, but he'll also be able to forge a little bit when he gets here. Or he'll be eating something at least. Could have made a butcher spot for the animals, too. I don't think I have the time, honestly. There's no foraging here. He has malnutrition. It's okay. Once we get here, we'll get food. And he should be able to forage once we're in the basic desert. Yeah, he gets a little bit of foraging here. It's the extreme desert that, that is the problem. Horses would have been cool. But we need a bow. We need to buy some wood. If we have wood, we can attack the dromedaries. At least he's getting some sort of food. Barracuda is very unlucky for where he crash land. Alright, Barracuda, you can make 
All right, he's forging a 4.1 a day now, so he should be able to, to actually get here without dying. At least we're neutral. If he doesn't break, we'll be okay. Oh, he's got severe malnutrition now. Come on, Barracuda, you can get there. Possibly should have done this beforehand. Oh, he's down. That's it for Barracuda. He's dead. Okay. So now that we got that out of the way. That was our first. This is my first game in over a year. But I think I remember everything now. And we will fire him back up with a new area. So that it's fresh and we don't know what's coming. No, Barracuda. And he's dead. And that's okay. Alright. Now that we know everything. Losing is fun. Commitment mode. We don't reload. We just die. And I want half the world. Gives us a little more options. We'll load build better good again. And now we have a much better idea of how to survive the first few days. I remember now. You don't stick around. You don't build things. You just grab steel and you go to the nearest town. Because we have to be somewhat near a town for trade. And we get wood. It allows us to do a lot of things. We want a larger map, but not too large. Yeah, extreme desert's what we're looking for. And something that's brutally hot that can kill us. And this is a good area. Not so far from a town. It's a little rough. This seems a little bit better here. Pirates are right there. This is probably pretty good. Somewhere over here, I think. Yeah, that seems about right. Not too close to the road. We want sandstone, marble, and granite. That's what we're looking for. Marble, granite, and sandstone. I prefer the sandstone to be first. But all three of them are in there. You can get a little bit better. Sandstone and slate, marble and sandstone, marble and granite, marble, sandstone, and limestone. I definitely don't want any mountains. I don't want to have to deal with any infestations. I mean, they're not terrible to deal with, but they can be really brutal. Wait a minute. There we go. Sandstone, granite, and marble. Year round. Decent temps. We'll be at risk heat stroke, but not too bad. Near a road. Not too far from that. That looks pretty good. Okay. We're going to load up uh, our dude again. Barracuda. And. One thing else we're going to do 
Did I not set the... I don't think I set the... Uh... Hmm. Gosh, we'll have to go back. Um, I gotta make sure that we set the tech to tribal. They're quiet 50%. Scenario editor. Edit mode. There we go. See, we don't want to be new rivals. We want to be new tribe. Did mess that up. Almost started that with uh, without the correct settings. And I, I do like that seed, so. Just set that back. One sec. I have to put this to orderless window. It's kicking me out whenever I go to my other monitor. Okay. So we, we found that one over here, right? Yeah. So this is the same seed. It should be right here. There it is. A little bit larger map. And I'll just have it start random. It might kill us. It might not. Load up Barracuda. Okay, so it wants us, <clears throat> because of the location, it wants us to have less points. So I can understand that. Um, we'll have less cooking. We need two crafting. Uh, we can have less intellectual. Hmm. 1,500 points is what it wants us to have. Let's see if I can find my other guy here. Basker Barracuda. There he is. No shooting skills. We're 11 points over, but that's okay. He has 5 points in crafting. Um, I have a bit of issue with some of this. Abandoned Child, Heart Tender. Sanguine's pretty good, but Nibble and Tough are pretty good too. This was my melee guy. But honestly... Those traits are, aren't that great. We're gonna have a psychopath. Absolutely. Jogger. Uh huh. And uh, industrious. You have to have them finish things quickly. Alright, so he has 11 points there. I took Abandoned Child. And Hearth Tender, which gave him uh, Meditation for Naturals. Social is my minus two, though. I kind of wanted him to be kind of a badass with shooting, though. So, I want to keep the point skill proper, but we need to change it around. But if we went none here, just removed it. Guess we don't have a choice for that. We could just make him younger. We could make him 17. And then he's just like a, a recruit. Yeah, do that. He's just an abandoned child then. All right, seems okay. All right. Uh, he needs to be able to shoot. Uh, he needs to be able to mine. And plant. He has to have at least two crafting. Which we have three. The medical. The social. I definitely still want. That's all we can do. Okay. That's it. That's the extent of. Oh. That's right. No melee. I need melee skill. 
Well, a little bit might not be bad, but. One in planting, at least one in cooking. Well, first point in mining is important. Uh, definitely one point in shooting. Just one point in all these really make a difference in his success rate early. Uh, the intellectual, not so big of a problem here. In fact, we can go a little less on that. And an extra point on shooting mining. Get one on plants. This is harvesting too. Okay. So he's just a young Vasco Barracuda. And this means we're at five, 1,500 points for the limit. We're at less than that. Uh, I think 1,500 points is probably a little bit better. I very want, much want him to be medical. This looks better, 1,512. We can take one point off of melee. One point off shooting. Okay, 1,487. That looks good. Okay. What are we waiting for? Oh, yeah, we'll just take that off. 32 points is fine. About 1,500. Under 1500 is where I want to keep it at. Anything else? Like Fat Jogger Industrious? Alright. I think we are ready to start. Let's see. Make sure we don't have any equipment. We do not. No relationships. Excellent. Do it. Okay. So we know a little bit more now. First things first. We get some planning done. We deconstruct some things. And then we go to trade. So let's see where we're at here. The overlay. And I want to plant near where we're going to be. So it looks like we're going to be in this area here. because We have three thermal geysers. So what we need to do, this is all steel we can deconstruct. Okay, and let's go ahead and add um, row first. And uh, go first, and then construct right after that. And once we have all this steel, we'll go trading it. Um, we're going to set up a growing zone here. And make this all right. And this one will be. And will be. All right, Barracuda, get to work. Barracuda. And it is winter. So this is kind of lucky for us. All right, that's enough for that for now. So give us all the steel we need to trade. Not having to mine it. Now, world, we want to set our sights, which is closer. They're hostile. They're not. That's where we're going. So let us form a caravan and go here. 1.2 days, take Barracuda. And we're going to take all the steel that we just mined. That should be good to go. And by the time that we get back, some of that food will be ready. And he'll be able to survive 1.2, given the fact that he has uh, some food. He's not hungry right now, basically. All right, very good. Get out there. I'm 
this road is going to let him move real fast. Mm -hmm. Provided he doesn't break on the way. He needs food. It'll be okay. Yep. I'm aware. We should get a little bit of forging here. It's 42 steel, which should be enough to buy some food. And we have reached Blue River. I lived in a town called Blue River when I was a kid. All right. So we have our steel, which we can sell off. We have a little bit of trade. Um, we're going to take some rice or potatoes or something we have 94 cents each the main thing we need here is wood and I think we need a sack here let me cancel that for a sack go back to um, our town here see how much wood we exactly need to make a bow So, if we craft a spot, we build down. So, make a short bow. Actually, we can make a recurve bow, I think. We need wood crafting. Five. Maybe that's why I have five crafting on him. Uh, recurve bow is 40 wood, and a short bow is 30 wood. We need at least 30 wood. We need 30 wood, regardless of what it is, we need 30 wood. Which we don't have enough capacity for. Can't carry 30 wood? My goodness. What happens if we accept this? And then, wait again. Oh, wait, we're going to do that. There we go. Okay. I'm like, I can't carry 30 wood. 30. How much are we stuck? Maybe 19? It's not enough, do we? They want a lot more for this wood than we have. We didn't bring all the... Did we bring... We didn't bring all the steel. That's okay. We'll just make another trip. Important thing is, right now we get food. Four four seventy two. That's that's too much. And this may not do a lot, but it will buy us time while our crops get made. Okay. So, send him back home. So that gave him a day's worth of food. Probably enough to get back home at least. And at least back home we planted that rice. So this has got the best soundtrack. I would like... Um, I like borderless window, but I guess that's fine. At least it, it still cuts out whenever I do that. <laughs> I'll go over here. Okay.
I'm actually going to put it back to full screen. All right. Life's not easy in the extreme desert, boys. That's fine. We're just buying time for these crops to come up, honestly. We can go harvest these crops and go pick up some more. Cougars jumping through the area. Because once we get some of these in, we'll be in better shape. The iguanas are gone, which sucked. Closer over here. Okay. We have arrived. Are we able to harvest anything yet? No. Nothing's in the area either. So immediately we're going to have to queue back up and head back out. And um, let's do this for now. Let's make a dumping uh, stockpile zone for all the steel. That should be more than enough steel for the trades. Okay, 59 steel, that's a lot better. I know, there's nothing we can do about it, because these aren't ready to be harvested yet. It only takes 1.2 days to get there. So, provided he survives, he sh and he should be able to be fine, given the fact that he just had catharsis. Yeah, his mood's okay. He can just get there, it'll be okay. Not sure why we only pulled 30 something. Feel the first one. That should have been more. I think we die here. I think we're gonna die because somehow we didn't have enough steel when I left the first time. He might make it. No, he's not going to make it. Can we load the game? Oh. Nope. Alright. I'm going to do this again. No, not that. Uh, make brutality, but custom. Is there... No, I don't have that. Okay. Uh, I'm going to make sure this is under tribe. One guy. Uh, commitment mode. Yeah. Just take this, see whatever it is. I'm not sure why we didn't pick up all the steel the first time. It's weird.
And we're getting a 1500 point limit again. Slightly large map. Alright, let's see what we got. Anybody can survive in the desert. Real man to survive in the extreme desert. These guys are hostile. These guys are not. Some place out here would be fairly ideal, I think. Marble, sandstone, and granite. And it's oh, we want to we want to be around growing tree. Want it to be hotter than that. Hostile. Uh, these guys. This would be good around here. Sandstone marble and slate, almost. There we go. Sandstone marble and granite. Pretty hot. Ah, uh, this is fairly close. Okay. So we know there's one there. Maybe someone closer to the road. Sounds like a guitarist in the mouth. Take that one. Carefully slow it down. Vasquez, who has under 1500 points. Uh, again, I want social. Plants are important to have for all these. Move all this stuff. Because I think it was originally a melee guy here. And we're going to make him 17, so we get the points. I want to change this around a little bit. Hearth Tender, cooking, crafting, and medical. That's why I took that, because it gives us the bow. Very much want him to be medically focused. That's all I can do, though. Crafting is 5 for the Reaper bow. I'm going to put one mining up and train shooting up very easily. And industrious again. Although I might think Barracuda is what I took last time. And I, um, I think I had these other traits when I went all the way with him. Am I putting 26 more for this? No, we went 1500. Regardless. Alright. Here we go. Here we go again. Right back. <laughs>
Oh, I... Boy. Because I love him. The best. Right. What'd you say? Yeah, he's in the bedroom. First things first. Right now. Spread out. This is a very spread out, guys. All right, let's find where the steel is. That's all steel. This might all be steel. Anything else? Slight. Come on. Slim pickets here. Well, let's get over here and do this. We will deconstruct. That'll give us enough trade. It's hostile. But that doesn't matter, does it? Okay. Uh, trading with the tribes are would be better for us. One point one six days per. Okay. A master of steel. We can 70 steel now. That's good. That's much better than the 20 we had last time. And the dirt road is fine. Alright, get out there. Blue must is. Yeah, I don't even have time to plan anything, really. I really just need to get a bow up, so anything that wanders into the area, we can kill. See that one mod I had to add this right here. This extra speed multiplier. So invaluable. Yep, I'm aware. As long as he gets here, we'll be okay. And there. All right. Take all that steel. Here's some. First priority, we get 40 wood. We don't have enough 40 wood. First priority is food, then. Because we're going to die without it. So we might have to make multiple trips here. Pemmican is pretty good. I, mean, I think we need less pemmican. So what this food means that we can actually go back and plant. And I hope we didn't plant before we left. 
This is a fairly good spot. 12 8 pemmican left, so we have a full trip back. Still an iguana on the map. We could kill the iguana. I think we're going to have to kill the iguana, plant food, and then go back with more steel. Assuming the Iguana is still there, they do not last there. Oh my god. This is a problem. We're not even planted. Because it's so hard to drive it. I have to hope something wanders in for me to kill. I've got to get something planted. The boat doesn't matter if there's nothing here to hunt. I have to go back again. We only have 63. I'm just gonna have to have something wanders in, or maybe I might have to kill the iguana first before we move out. Because the iguanas only stay for a day. Oh, wait, he's got a tonic. It's just kind of mental break. Alright, try again. Uh, I think I know now. Try it for... Try... One. Random. One. Good mode. A little more world with. So, drop, plant food, kill an iguana. Get steel. Go to the trade. Go back and forth with trade until our food is up. And then we'll gain a little bit of time. We have to plant a bunch of food before we leave. Okay. So, let's find the desert. Uh, these guys are hostile. These guys are hostile. These guys are hostile. These guys are not friends. Are this desert? Please stream desert. These guys are, but there's a lot of pirates here. But it's the price, it's the price we pay. This one marble is pretty good. There's only it's just an year round growing period though. Problem I have. Is green okay? Green is not okay. 
I don't think the seed worked. I'm not sure does it. Another seed. Stream does it again. This is fairly close. So on the equator, like over here. Yeah. It's tough to get to that though. Get there. Ah, oh, over here. Ah, oh, this is better. Prime here. Marble and stone and asphalt road. There's granite, marble, and sandstone. That's pretty close. Let's see if there's anything closer. The reason why we want granite is because it's strong. We make our walls later. We want them to be really, really, really strong. Sandstone is easy to work with first. Marble, sandstone, and granite. Not, not around growth period though. So here we are. Let's get around our here. Down to work. Let's just get around. This could work. Yeah. Uh, cost? No, they're not. Good. Switch kind of range up here. Pretty good. Hopefully, this brain up here. There we go. That looks good. That looks pretty good. Flat. Sandstone, marble, and granite, the order we want. Go load up uh bear. When it does speak answer. Ah, this is the one I did for um Wait, wait, wait. This is I think this is the one I used to get all the way through. Yeah, I used Bloodlust. Very tough simple. He was a melee guy. Using a sword. If you don't know this, the melee guys, oh, point is 3,500, so, crap. Um, so, oh, we have this drill. 1820. I had medical, social, and melee. He was a fighter, built, and, um, destroyed things. <laughs> Very fun to play. And the bloodlust was really cool. Um you can see that. He never gets he never turns from blood to death. He has no problem with bodies around. It's tough. And he dodged a lot. This guy was good. Street rat. I didn't have him doing any uh, researching all just beating things down i think we're gonna go with that we can try to get down to 1500 points i would like to stay on along the 1500 point threshold basically he was a cult leader. He's a king, but I, I made him. Half number of bloodless. Let's go with him. 
Seems pretty good. I like the space pirate thing too, but something like beating something with your hand. With this guy, we can just deconstruct something like this and then make a club with that. And then we can go put down a graphic spot, make a club. How much, what do we need to make the club? 40 ingredients? Yeah, that, this will give us that. Sixteen, twenty, and we have enough. So work. Okay, we're gonna make sure that doctoring is number one. Uh, bed rest is number four. Paint, research, art. So he makes this, and then we go murder the guanas. And we're gonna make sure he can self tend. Okay. Okay. And steal. And we draft him. And we go kill this iguana right. Here. I kind of need to kill all the iguanas. Why did he doesn't get wrecked there? It'd be okay. Now we have a source of food. And we're gonna go ahead and make a little something stock now here. And we need to dig into the dirt so we can get heat stroke. Gonna dig deep in here. Make a little room. And also what we can do is make a little uh, butcher spot here. So then we get actual meat. So Aguana will go a lot farther. There we go. We have a little bit of uh, lizard skin too. That's 12. This is super slow first. Um, we need to build a Steel hoop ring inside. We still need to extract the rest of the stuff. Better eat. And I don't have a sleeping spot for him. He just sleeps outside. At least at recreation, we'll get up. It'll help out a lot. Okay. Uh, wildlife, we need to kill the other thing first. he gets tired. Please carry that back. Okay. 
And then he'll get up and he'll eat the iguana. And we gotta kill the other iguana before it leaves. Vasca Barracuda. All right, I'd like to get the work done while it's still well, light out. This is going to be raw food, but this will be a this will be a lot of food if we get it raw like this. Ah, schedule. That's right. To put this to anything. Okay. Good. Now he'll haul it back. Now we'll have food for the next day. He's going to butcher it. It's fine. Uh, I did not mean to make that there. Deconstruct that. Yeah, that's fine. We we're gonna do this anyway. Sad wander. It's not not a big deal. Just need to mind the sound a little bit. Actually, hmm, maybe we just put some growth on. Grow some things first. the rice and then go to trade. I think that's probably a better plan. Just order deconstructing all this. There's still columns too. We'll have catharsis after this. Okay, we have some food. So we'll have them grow first and then at least we'll get some food down. Cargo pot. Maybe that has food. Do I have chocolate? Oh, we very much. Thank you. Love you. On. This isn't worth a lot of nutrition value, but it will keep us going. And we do need to get a, some defenses down. Oh yeah, we need to get all urgently to number one. All urgently, all plus, there we go. This gives us a nice little mood boost too. Not a lot of food. It does give us a mood boost. Yeah, our mood is sky high. Well, Catharsis too. It does satisfy recreation for a while. It's going to allow us to actually plant more food here.
I was very fortunate to get those drop offs. Actually, trade away the chocolate also. It's worth a lot. Wizard. We can trade. Cool. Trade the chocolate. Trade with him. Chocolate's worth a, a buck forty. Actually, survival, no, which is full. That's worth three full meals. Medicine, too. Full. I think we just sell all the chocolate and get three the pack of survival meals. That's good. We don't have to travel. It's very fortunate. Very fortunate. That is a really good gift. So look, five minutes. Amazing. Thank you, Randy Random.
10. I'm going to call last one. Cash pod. She is what fashion. Oh, doesn't have any. I'm going to do some really bad things. Maybe not, since the um, psychopath is part of the organ, but you know, like, do. So, and I'm not going to bother with her. I needed to disable random join. Hopefully you won't have a problem with it. I don't want her in the call. It's not going to be rest. No. Very bad. We do need to get more food. I think that is food. Good enough. I'm not going to waste a crap on an iguana. Yeah, we're not going to do that. Don't want you to heal her, man. We can get her back to walking and then we can leave her. Damn it. I don't have the food to take care of her, so. Let's go to the
That's not good. Oh. <clears throat> Barely. And I'll walk. Although I'm going to get a penalty now. Die. Hopefully Barracuda doesn't die. You're really bad. Okay, he's out of it. Hopefully he isn't dying. Moderate malnutrition, he may die. I'm gonna get up and move, Bob. That was really, really unfortunate. Break there. Didn't really break there. It's just Lyra. Although Barracuda is next. That's severe malnutrition. He may not make it. He can see the town and die. Rest. Get him. Well, get a little forage. We got a little food. Might be enough to keep him awake. might get enough just to get there. He is getting there. Boy, was that close. We don't really use.
We hear a die. Not a problem. Many people will be dying. She has some food. And this stuff is pretty hard for me. Much better shape, so. Okay, put the medicine inside. We still have three medicine. Create a couple of way, and that's okay. Point to uh, first. This up. Uh, we're gonna start working on our. I really love the soundtrack. It's probably my favorite soundtrack of any of the games. And this stuff is ready to harvest. I mean, we don't have to harvest it, but it is ready. We, we need food. We can we, we have it. Uh, is there anything? Let's see what his inventory is now. Okay, so I think he's out of, yeah, he didn't have any food left, so let's go ahead and harvest some of it. Not a lot, just, just a little bit of it. And it's a little cooler inside here, usually, I think. As we can keep him fed, it'll be okay. You need to consume this rice right now, bro. Okay. Now we need to work on getting wood. 
Looks like we can put a little, some over here. Wood. We don't have enough for it. Need six skill. Let's see where we're at. We will have six skill at some point, but let's see where it's at now. His plants is at four, so we're we're getting there. Barracuda will have enough skill for it. Um, we should probably repurpose a table. That's a steel table. I would like to actually use that for its raw resource. See if there's any other tables around. Big table, too. Oh, there's a smaller table over here. Okay. I'm going to this and reinstall it here inside of our little cave. We're going to make a little chair also. Okay. Just so that our boy can um, have a place to eat so he's not at a major break risk anymore. This will go a long way. This is almost fully grown. So we have all this food here very, very quickly. And now he has a table to eat at. He's an extreme break risk. He might end up breaking here. These are all ready to harvest. As he harvests them, more will get ready. And it is five degrees cooler indoors than it is outdoors. So that is a success there. Next thing we're gonna do is make him a bed. Oh, we can't get him a bed, can we? I thought we had bed was Standard. Huh. Bed rolls. Interesting. We cannot make him a bed. Alright, that's fine. Okay. <clears throat> we will need to build him probably an Ur game board though. Uh, we can probably deconstruct this. Make it out of these two. What is the table there? Sandstone. Limestone, too. Make him an herb board. Okay, this is okay. He has food around. The days is fine. As long as we don't get attacked. <clears throat> Whoops. Okay. We are absolutely okay with this day. Could have been worse. And we do need to clean all this stuff up, so. I mean, it's at the cleaning, though. This is not a home area. None of this stuff is home area. None of this stuff is home area. I absolutely want to keep this clean. The cleaner it is, the um, happier he's going to be. All 
All right, so this is the number one priority, getting the food here. He may have the six we need now. Let's check his uh, farming. He is still at four. That's not ideal, but it's okay. I'd like to get that out of the way too. That seems like a good idea. But now we're not dependent on animals rolling in or trade. It's just going to take us some time to build up now. We do have to worry about raiders, but we have that covered here with the traps. Not sure. Oh, I, I, have, I don't have it set to food. That's right here. Uh, foods. I'll switch it here. But only fresh foods. And we will use that limestone to make a power board. Because if he doesn't have variety, uh, he will not um, be happy. Up here. It's fine. And we want to quality to good, I think. Actually, awful is fine. Anything is fine that he can build right now. He's not a master builder. We need to expand this a little bit more now. Okay, now we have several days worth of food. We have enough food that we're self-sufficient now. Oh, I've built made potatoes. That's actually okay, given the fact we have all this rice now. I'm gonna let him complete all the tasks that I gave him. Barracuda. Okay, we're gonna build this herb board. If he doesn't get, he'll be bored of the same task over and over again. He just needs one extra thing. This will make sure that his mood stays fairly high. Uh, start doing some of this. When he gets six planting, is when we can work on wood and actually start doing temperature controlling. We'll have him sleep in the daytime. It's not a bad idea right now. Sleep during the hottest part of the days. Has he done all the tasks I gave him? He's cleaning now. Uh, that should not be part of the song. Down here. That means that we need to clear more of this. Okay. Alright. We should just be clearing this stuff. Good. As long as he keeps it clean, food will go up. What now? build a campfire or stove. We don't need fuel or wood. We make some. And we should probably assign recreation time when he first wakes up.
He has the flu. It's not great. Um, we do have medicine, though, so we will be okay. He does need to be on bed rest, though. Hey, a bulkage trader. Cool. Um, bed rest is pretty important at this point with when you have the flu. But he needs to be in bed. Get in bed. Get the flu. It is tended though, so that was good. And with the medicine means we're gonna beat this with immunity. We won't die into it. Flu is dangerous. It can kill you. He's on bed rest now. I need to trade. Him. Uh, it's not really affecting our price. We can get a lot of for the steel. Oh, some for the steel. They're not buying steel. They're buying rice. No. <laughs> I don't need anything here. Don't have anything that we can trade. No, back on bed rest, sir. Resting will increase your immunity as well as medicine. All right, that's probably enough. I don't need to use that. Actually, I better use that because if he breaks right now, it'll be a big problem. Doctor's number one, better is number two. If he has a, a, a break right now without being tended again, it is very problematic. All right, he's gonna beat this. We can take, we can get out bed rest. Mood should be improving. Awful bedroom, I know. It's probably awful too. It's a good quality board, wow. Normal quality this. Or quality stool. Yeah, that's we're fine. Oh he's catatonic? Fine. He's he's already uh He'll, he'll be fine with the immunity on the flu. He will beat it. Yeah, fine. We, need, we are a dog. This is exactly why I use the medicine on this flu. And we may not need it again. We're 11 points over it. Usually it's a race. He does need tending. But he should wake up and tend to come flu. This is one of the worst ones, the catatonic, because they don't eat. They would, yeah. Come on, Barracuda. Maybe he'll pass out from sleep. You gotta get up and eat, homie. Ooh. 
Ooh. Um. Man. Five Critter World Medicines. Rainy Thunderstorm for 11 days. This uh, also is good for us, actually. I'm going to take it. And why am I going to take it? Because it's five Glitter World Medicines. This stuff is so good. If you are in danger of dying, you just use it and you're, you're good to go. If he dies to starvation, I'm going to be fucking pissed. Come on, Barracuda. Wake up, boy. You got food? I know it's tough. You can do it. He's got moderate malnutrition now. Alright, I think he's at it. No, he's still at a tonic. Come on, bro. And he does need to heal himself with medicine. Come on, man. We died of this. I'm just gonna be really upset. He's been catatonic for days now. It's a random amount of time, I think. Sucks he has medicine and flu right here. He's losing the fight against the flu. If he doesn't wake up now. I don't think he can get up now. I think we died with a stupid catatonic. So stupid. He's still catatonic. Just dumb. Just really dumb. Well, at least I can uh, edit the scenario to make sure that we get no people coming in. And lose their catatonic that might last forever. God, that's so terrible. He's not supposed to stay catatonic for three days. Okay. I forgot to do something. Uh, we need to change some things here. Major threats question. Yeah, all the threats, yes. Harvest yield's fine. Um, we want to make sure we don't get any random uh, events that add people to us. Maybe that's in the back. <clears throat> Here we go. Add part. Um, that's what we needed. 
improvement game condition. No. Okay. Uh, disable incident. Wanderer join. Ambush manager. No. I'll be fine. The only thing we don't want people is to join. Man in black is so cool. Is that a beja joint? Is that what it is? No? Yeah, let me look it up. Yeah, that's the abasia join is really what we want to prevent. And let's see if we can also... If there's any other join we can remove. Oh yeah, I don't know, wild magic one is fine. I think that's that's a wander joint together. Okay. Basically, nobody joins. No, we don't want them. That's it. That's the only thing I don't want to have in there. Okay. Back to losing is fun again. All right. Those are the two incidents I forgot to add on the last uh, playthrough, on the last run. Really tough at the desert to get it to work. I'm not sure I did the desert when I did it. I think I did it on regular desert. Extreme desert is just brutal. Around the center somewhere. Oh, this would be great. It was there. Don't look like there's anything suitable over here. Maybe over here. This is cool. Not extreme desert though. Only extreme desert here. That could work. And sandstone and marble. There it is. Sandstone marble and granite. That's the one right there. That looks good. And we'll use dirt. Want to make him a fighting guy, a melee. Bloodlust is really good for fighters. Tough is cool too. All right, so we're gonna break him back down to fifteen hundred, right? I want to get one there. Do we need one there? Um, I kind of want one there. Crafting is too... I don't really need it. Yeah, we do for... Make a bow if we need it. Do we need a bow? We do. I'll make him 17 again. I'll make him 19. Seems fine. Just a kid. Kid in the world. Hey, Rakuda. There he is. That's our Barracuda right there. Alright, we gotta reduce some points. Oh, I wanted to, I wanted to have higher plants so that we could get wood, but we gotta stay under 1500. If we want it to be a challenge, we gotta stay under 1500. Alright, here we go again. Very basic dude. No stuff. 
low amount of points. Unforgiving environment. Okay, see what we're working with here. And it's spring, so not so great for us. There is stuff over here, and this is slate, but this is all steel over here. And steel is easy to work with, disassemble, and is worth a significant amount. So, do this. We're gonna first thing we're gonna do is sew this area over here. Uh, that's what this is. Sew this with rice. Rice. Why not rice? All this with rice. Alright, so then we have given them something to do. And then we will set up this track over here. And the priority here is grow and then struck. Doctor is always number one. Okay. Then we will make a little crafting area here. Go get us some food. Do need any time for all this? And I didn't quite leave any shelter out here, but that's okay. We'll just mine into this steel. A little crafting spot down here. Go ahead and craft a club out of anything we can find. How is his food? Probably get on craft first. Okay, let's get on that crafting. We're a little bit done now. We need 40 units for the club thing. That'll be done. He's meditating? Ooh, okay. Is he have magic yet? I don't know. He is tribal. Street rat. Okay, let's go ahead and make a club. Should have enough materials to make it. Okay, we made the club. Put the club, and let's go kill some animal. There's no other. There they are. Fox and Juana. Juana looks fairly close. And he's tough and nimble, should have no problem here. This wouldn't be a bad spot to set up camp also. Right? Stop there, go down. And do your wounds. And we're going to prioritize all of that. Mm, can you haul back this? Because you need to. Uh, we'll go back to planting first. And then construct.
Okay, I'll let you go eat now. Good. <clears throat> okay. We need to go to kill this other iguana before he leaves. I'd like you to get him before he wakes up. Awesome. As long as he doesn't get any scars. Uh, getting a scar this early. So, oh, we got sheep. Oh, that's cool. And just murder them. Ooh. The lucky event. Because they won't survive out here anyway. Oh. We will be slaughtering them. Post haste. Well, if we have those guys, we we'll probably actually put a butcher spot in play. They'll, they'll stay alive for a while, though. The problem is they're going to eat our stuff. Alright, time to wake up. Okay. Get to planting. Manhunter pack. Spot. That's probably gerbils or something. Raccoon. Scaria. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Sad water? No! Well, attack. They aren't attack sheep. Okay, but they might fight back if the raccoons attack them. I think Barracuda might actually fight back too. Yeah, they do fight back. Yeah, they're gonna. They're gonna kill off the rats. The raccoons. Okay. There was two. He's a bit of heat stroke. Not ideal. So we have all this food here. I guess we go ahead and um, start to mine in here. This is granite, though. It's going to take a while. So that does suck. However, if we can get deep in here, we'll be much better off with temperature. He ever comes out of this sad wander. Be better to dig into its sandstone. I'm gonna do that. This the granite is really hard. So is steel. Just dig in here. Just be in here for a bit. Not ideal, but it'll work for now. Okay. Yeah, we knew that was going to happen. They are going to die. Okay, he needs to consume the ram. All these things are going to die. And before the corpses rot, we have to... Um... We have to butcher them. Oh, let's remove this here. And let's expand this over here because we need to be closer over there. These two. It's fine to keep this growing season over here. That's okay. Just won't re sow it. We won't re sow it after it's grown. Hmm. 
All right, Barracuda, anytime you want to wake up. Well, it's two days. Okay. Now, they will eat any vegetation that is big enough for them to eat. So they might actually start eating our rice, which is kind of okay. Because it allows us to keep them alive as a food source. Rice is the only thing we can really grow right now. More rice. More rice for the rice gods. And we need to get some sort of recreation for him up. Oh. Heal hoop scale ring. Alright. Yeah, he's too hot, I know. You can actually make a little travel mill, maybe. We slaughter these. We butcher them. So let's try and build a butcher table. Well, we can't do that given the fact we have no wood. Alright, so it's okay now. Let's do it for a while. And when these rams die, and they will shortly, let's go ahead and butcher them. So we're going to slaughter one of these. And make this a priority. Make this a priority. That gives us some plain leather. We can actually use to make Tribal wear. We need 60 ingredients. We're going to be just shy. Because we ate that other thing. It's funny. Need to haul this out of here. I put a door here. Oh, it's sand. Okay, put it there though. I mean, there's no storage space. Should be dumping stockpile.
This is uranium. Yep, I know. Ram died. It happens. Longer I can wait, the better. And then he's gonna start to eat our crops here. It's okay. Keep one of these rams alive. Okay, we'll go down. Wake up, Barracuda. Let's go talk with Slater. If we got anything for him, he's got pemmican. We got slaves, which can't have for we, Oh, herbal medicine would be so nice. Yeah, we don't have anything to sell him now. That sucks. We have food. environment's very ugly. Nothing I can do about it right now. Let's see if I find a table at least. Slim pickings on the table department. Wow, there are no tables. Oh, there's one. Nope, there's no tables around. That is really weird. Usually there's at least one. All right, we'll make a table then. We do need a little bit more room. He sucks at mining. better at mining yet? Well, he's got a two in mining now. That's a lot better than zero. By a wide amount. And I will have enough to make travel wear. Maybe. No. There's no way. This is about 0% chance I will have to do that. Gotta make sure to keep him full. We need to stay away from extreme brick risk. Clean all this stuff up. It's better. And then we will go ahead and build a table and a stool. So now he'll let me have some price to eat. All right, that solves one of those problems. Naked, cramped interior, we need to, yeah, it needs more space. It's fine. Put another sleeping spot over here. Put that one. Buddha, street rat. Ugly environment, minus 10, yes. Uh, moving this stuff out will help a lot. I 
How's he doing on food? He's low. It's time to slaughter this sheep. Let him get a little bit of rest. Okay. Need to eat. There we go. Now he's eating at a table. I think we want to clean this stuff up first. Okay. That rest up. So I'm going to stay out of extreme rake risk and even major would be nice to stay out of. Now he's not confined either. I'm going to try and give him a little bit more room here. He has a spacious room, and he does better. And then we'll smooth what walls we can. Okay, okay before we do anything else, you're going to need to put up some sort of security. And that's probably the best place I can put him for now. If we get raided, I may end up dead. We don't have at least these traps up. And I don't want to die. Okay. That's enough to survive the first couple of raids. Okay, and let's give us a little stockpile area just for food. And that's the preferred stockpile for food. We'll take that out. Look at his needs. Okay, we have rice there. He's okay. Okay. And let's also get the stuff hauled in. And indoors so it doesn't deteriorate. more food. He has food. Okay. Go eat, son. Go get some sleep. Okay, we're not going to sew this stuff anymore. I'm going to harvest it out. That's we're going to leave the zone up. Okay. This stuff we still will. And then we will go ahead and add another growing zone over here. And why not one over here? Fine. Nice. 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 And does he have six planting yet? He. As six planting, oh my goodness, we can actually build some uh, food now. I mean, some wood. So we'll get some cacti. And this one will be cactus too. All right, and that'll give us wood. And uh, bloodlust is good because we don't care about any of the blood that's going to be piling up around here. All right. Visitors to the colony.
Okay, so next thing we really need to do is something with this plain leather, which we don't really have enough to make anything. But his planting is getting better. We do need to make a fur board for him. And I think it's still being fine. Right there next to the chair. I kind of want to make that a priority. As long as I keep him working on things that he has a passion for, he'll be better off. Yeah, my passion for my work. We need to eat again. And we're going to extend this out a bit. He's in serious pain from what? Oh, he got street. Here is serious heat stroke. That's not good. Not being indoors would cure that. Very much need wood. Takes I think fifty. To make a passive cooler. Just do not have enough. You only make it out of wood too. He's just kind of wrecked. I'm fairly deep underground. Hopefully the night will alleviate some of this. We might need to go to town and get him something. Um, let's take a look at the world. Alright, we can probably get him some cyberware there. It might be a little bit cooler in the other area. Take him, 33 kilos. We will take um, all the steel we can carry. And we'll take a little bit of rice. I don't want you out of Mexico, Charles. Take uh, 40 units of rice. The rest of steel that allows us to take a lot more. Yeah, I understand, but they can trade for food there. We need to get out of this uh, desert climate. Try and get some tribal air or something. Oh yeah, we can just get some wood. That'd be another thing we could get. I mean, he'll survive a day. <laughs> Hopefully. Okay, well, he's berserk, but at least he's berserk somewhere else. And he will automatically consume the food. Uh, 
Uh, wart? No. Okay. I mean, it's worth some money, at least. If we come out of this berserk. One scavenger gunner. Doesn't seem like very good reward for us. All right, he's on the move again. He's off, off a berserk, thank goodness. We will have to use some of the profits to buy food. At least he's foraging some. He's moving so slow. I don't think we make it. I think we have to go back. The heat stroke is very debilitating. I think we're too far. Well, hold on. Point six days. Point eight days. Wait, no. Point seven days. This is point eight days. We might as well just continue the trade. Yeah, if it's point eight days, because once he gets to this road, I guess it's pretty quick. Oh, he's back. He's okay now. He's back to the initial st stroke. Okay. Ooh, must be why. No way he's moving so slow if he's at 100%. Must be the tile. If you enter it at a certain amount, then you have to stay on that. He's getting some foraging at least. Okay, once he gets to the road, it'll be okay. Yeah, much faster on the road. Okay, it's all of the steel. We'd like plain leather, if possible. They don't have any of that. Do they have any clothing? No. You have wood, though. So we can take some wood back. Make enough wood to get a bow, but we're not really using that. Uh, we have planting six, though. I think all we need really is we need a day's worth of food to get back. About 20. We have 22 left. And frankly, I might just take solar. Now let's take the wood. The wood's too valuable. Okay. Head back. So now he's got a full belly. Yeah, the heat stroke sucks, but um, heading out of the colony might have helped us out, out of the extreme desert. I don't see what that's saying. Maybe it's uh, 
past the heart on this part of the ear. I don't know. Anyway, let's get this wart back. We can sell that out to the next trader that stops by. Now let us change the uh, home zones. This, I don't care about that right now. I just want to set the cleaning zones. This does do fire though too, but also does mostly cleaning. I just want to make sure that he cleans in, indoors. He doesn't mind blood. He does mind dirt. Okay, this wart is kind of valuable. He's worth 250. Where steel is only worth uh, $1.90. We got some wood finally. And when we grow these out, we'll have a lot more. Time to bring in the harvest. We definitely have too many growing zones now. He's in days. Good. This is just a, a minor break. It's not like being catatonic. Nope, still in the days. At least he's sleeping. He will eat too, I believe. Okay, so the wart is gone. It's unfortunate, but you know what? It happens. And I'd like to get that leather, but there's not much I can do about it. Except maybe put a stockpile somewhere. Leather in there. Sure, but I'm gonna go ahead and call that out. Oh, something died. Box killing things. Dying of starvation or illness is the worst thing right now. Getting medicine might be something we need to go do. Okay, once we get this wood up, we will be able to um, control the temperature. Means he won't get heat stroke. Heat stroke is very problematic. Ugh. <sighs> No. I think he might have heat stroke right now, but the temperature's going down. He should actually pull out of this. Yeah, he'll be he'll be okay. Is 
It's now 28 degrees. It's just a temperature thing. Okay, he needs to eat. Now, okay, we need to get... We need to get the temperature control up right now. We don't have enough wood. Thankfully, it's early morning, though. So the heat strokes back to an initial. Getting this wood down is, is probably the most important thing we can do right now. Hi, Barracuda. You can do it, buddy. You have 36 wood now. You need 50. I'm hoping we get raided. Then we can kill the raiders. And get some clothing. Can I make a stove? I don't have any room, so it matter, does it? Good news is this is all done here. We don't have to mess with this anymore. We have all the food we need out of there. Wood is going to be very important from now on because we need to start cooking food. We need to get the temperature under control. We get a heat wave, we just die. You eat, please. Yep. Keep that mood up, buddy. He's in serious pain from heat stroke again. Great. Oh, good news, the temperature's going down again. He is berserk. Well, the things we have to deal with. As long as it doesn't go catatonic. Of course, I don't know how this is going long. This is going to last. He does need to eat. It really depends if this was uh, a major or an extreme. I think Berserk tends to last a shorter amount of time than the other ones. Because he's really destructive during this time. Oh, 
All right, yeah, did not last that long. Okay, so work. Uh, we need grow. All right, so there's a manhunter pack. It's a couple squirrels, and that's okay. Uh, we should have no problem killing them. Yeah, I know he has heat stroke, and that's fine. We have two traps up here. And the temperature should be dropping again. A little hot doors. Oh, this is bad. It doesn't get out of this heat stroke. We have a big problem. I wanted to be deep underground, but that may not be deep enough. Might have to be even somewhere like this, but can't get in there. It's granite. There's no way we'd be able to get in there. God damn it. If we die again, I'm going to be so pissed. It's 41 degrees. I think he's dead. It's hotter in here than it is outside. Please wake up. Okay. 34 degrees inside. 32. 31. Come on. Wake up. Come on. 30. Maybe we need to do more trading. Get that wood. I don't want this person, but this may be my only chance to save Barracuda. Absolutely have to now. The heat wave. Damn it. And son of a ah. Uh. Oh, man. Whew. I should probably save this also. Hey, Randy, you are such a bastard. Really? We have to be deeper into the rock. We're going to have to change some things here. It means we need to focus more on mining. Whoops. Ah. I think I crashed RimWorld by right clicking. Well, that wasn't good. Did I crash it? I think I did. My goodness. Huh. All right. 519 hours in RimWorld. 
That's absurd. I played this game a lot a year ago. Or maybe a year and a half ago. An absurd amount of time. Let's check something here. Okay. Uh <sighs> Okay, uh, tribal one. Uh, just start standing then. Don't drop bonds are needed. At part. Just don't want any. We don't want any help. Any wanders, any anything. So, wanderer join. Nope. And a blazer join. No help whatsoever. Animals can join. It's okay. All right, Randy, random. All right. Looks pretty good over here. Just very close to a town, too. That's good. Can't be too close for us to get pissed. Right, Grant Sandstone and Marble seems pretty good. Right next to the road and up the way from the town. Yeah. A little bit bigger map. Uh, let's just do random start. I just, if we die, we die. Oh, every 15 days. I... Stone and granite are the two most important things, but I would like to have marble. Let's see if we can get marble. These are all, those are hostile. That, these are all hostile over here. That's not for us. We want to be on the other side of them if possible. There's any other places possible here? It's just, like, just regular desert. This is it. I'll be here or nothing. Marble, granite, and sandstone. There it is. Is that good? Are we good here? Yeah, we are good there. Uh, we may need to make a change to Barracuda here, though. Let's just use whatever point limit we have. 295, we're over. Okay. Um, I guess we will turn his age down to 19. Barracuda the street rat. And uh, one less in social. Definitely one more in mining.
I don't really want to have him spend his time researching his thing. I do want to get good shot prices. <laughs> Turn medical at four. That's at four. Well, that seems about right. And we need mining. Dang it. Shooting. We're not going to be shooting. He's not a shooter. He's a beater. That's who he is. Barracuda Vasquez. Alright. Looks okay. He's not very smart, but he don't have to be. Alright. Yeah, I think I am. Alright, first things first. Get a club. Don't look wanna some crops go to trade let's see where everything is we need to find the steel there's gold that is now our number one priority I think Well, it's worth a lot. Not only is it worth a lot, we can also carry a lot of it. And we have two skill. I think we have three skill now. Yeah, he, he went up in skill. So we get all this gold. And put a stockpile on there. Now, going to... Go trade. All the gold. That's a lot of money. And I know he doesn't have a lot of food, but he should be able to make it there. That is going to set us off right. This is going to carry us through. Once he gets to the road, he'll be walking pretty fast. Yeah. All right. There we go. So, we have a lot of gold, which is worth a lot. So, we can get uh, a few simple meals that will last a few days. And we could probably actually get enough wood to build our first cooler. We won't up and die again. Okay. And mind getting some sort of weapon, but this is too expensive for us. Okay, I want to see if we can get something that will probably be pretty good. Can't light duster. Insulation from heat is 20 degrees Celsius. I 
What else do we have for stuff? Celtic shirt is not gonna work. Cloth pants. A little bit of insulation, but not much. This camel hide duster, I think we're gonna have to get. This mm, area. And uh, I would mind getting a couple medicines. And chocolate's a bit expensive, but it might be worth it for a bit for the recreation. Okay, and then the rest of it will probably be just food. Oh, right they have a bed. You don't. Plasma swords are nice to have. That's about it. I wouldn't mind getting. I guess we take the cloth. Also, the pants. So we're not naked. A bit expensive, but I think we need to take it. I don't think we can take more than six of these, though. And we'll just keep the rest in cash. That works. Oh, wait. We need to head back. Barracuda. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, we could have gotten more wood, but we're okay for now. So allow us to plant. And we'll try and get deep into a cave. We can't build it very big because of infestations, but we can get a little bit deep into it. So the temperature's down. That is the 3rd of April, May. That means that in a very short period of time, it's going to get very, very hot. So, find out where we're going to be. This looks like the best place for us, although there might be an ancient picture there. But this we can get in pretty deep. There's some farmland out here. In the sky. Let's build us a little room in here. Ooh, no, no, no. Barracuda, you need to put that clothing on. There we go. Now he shouldn't be so hot. <laughs> That's 20 degrees of insulation. And speaking of now that we've done that, first of all, let's turn this to anything. And uh, make some growing zones. That should be okay. That should be more than enough food. 
grow should come first. At least she's not naked now. Phew. And we need to move all that stuff over here. Permanent summer, okay. This should be enough food. I, I hope. Sincerely hope it's enough food. And this chocolate should satisfy his recreation for a while. I hope. Enough to get this down. Okay. I got a better feeling about this one. We need to get some sort of security up also. Where's the nearest steel? Anything? There's steel walls, kind of walls, or steel tables. I'll mark those for deconstruction. Are these steel urns? Good. That helps out a lot. Well, they do want a table, that's a bit big. I'd like to get a marble table if I can find one. All steel. Heat wave. I am so glad that we have stuff that we need here. Okay, so we're out of food. That's okay. Uh, getting the mining done first is going to be our other priority. We have 20 degrees to play with now, or 21 degrees with that duster. That duster is really big for us. Means he probably doesn't get heat stroke. Yeah, they have a few items to trade. Donkey's joint, cool. And slaughter those guys. Or trade them off to these guys. That'd be the best thing to do. We just trade them off right now. Well, but they do have pemmican. We do have 53. So let's just do that. Now he has a little more food. Just wait for the donkeys to die. Bye bye, thanks for the pemmican. Oh, he ate my pemmican. Ooh, you donkey. And you're gonna eat my chocolate too? Damn it, donkey. Well, I guess we'll be slaughtering those guys. There's, um, production, put your spot. Oh, you donkey, you get slaughtered. All right, let's prioritize doing this. Get him out of the way. 
Give him some food. Took my recreation though is the problem here. And we need to deconstruct this stuff now. So I need to build a hoopstone ring right now. Oh shoot, those are slate blocks. Those are steel. Oh, we can build a lot of slate, that's fine. Go ahead and build this now, please. Maybe they'll buy it. That'd be nice. <sighs> if they bought the donkey, I'd like that very much. Is there anything of a trade? No, oh, there's a trader. Okay, get a little closer. Don't be shy. They have medicine. No, they don't have medicine. They do have medicine. And package survival mail. We don't have anything to trade them. I'm not trading my medicine away. So that's not going to happen. We'll need to put a slight door on here. Which I should have the resources for. And that means this whole player will be indoors. It should be cooler now. Oh, that is good for a second soothe. And I do need to get... Oh, I got the slate already. Right, let's get a door on here. There we go. And we're going to put the sleeping spot in here. Hallelujah. And then we'll claim a table somewhere. Hope we have a table. Right row. Would have been nice to have a table here. Oh well, we'll just build one. Slate table. Hopefully we have no blocks. Uh, we do barely have enough blocks for it, and that's cool. Ooh, the donkey meat running away. No, the donkey meat. We will need to eat this donkey. Very, very soon, I think. So we got some plain leather out of it.
Oh, we got a table. All right, it's time to slaughter the donkey. Good. Goodbye, donkey. Goodbye, donkey. All right. Uh, that's not the home zone, so let's start clearing the home zone out. That is the home zone. Keep this clean. Can I make a plain leather bed roll? can. Holy crap, I can. Uh, that's also not the home area. Oh, having him sleep in a bed would be really nice. Okay, he's got a bed roll now. Barracuda. Okay, so got most of it done. Uh, it's much cooler in indoors now. It's by six degrees, but we have a duster, so that's not really a huge deal. I don't really want to make this room any bigger than this because infestations are, are a problem. I would like to mine out some more of this stuff outside, though. While we wait for the rest of the food to come in. Let's see if he's at six yet from all that. He is at five, so we might want to make another zone for growing. This is this is enough food, I think. Yeah, that's enough food. I'm just gonna have to wait till the harvest comes in. Okay, any other problems now? Ugly environment. Yeah, I understand that. Well, we can smooth this stuff out too. And that'll make it actually quite pretty in here. It'll give him something to do in the interim. Okay. Um, do you want to move stockpile stuff into here? And make that the preferred one. Uh, but no metals or stone blocks. And nothing rotten. Okay, that's fine. So we are ready for the next heat wave. Yeah, it's, that's significantly cooler indoors. Having all this rock around us is really good. This is mining at. Mining's at uh, four now. It's not bad. Is so much faster at four plus at, uh, and like two plus is so much faster. One is almost twice as fast as zero. Just deck tap tap. The one that goes tap tap tap. I lost the donkey meat. That's okay. This is harvestable now, and we're gonna have to do some of it.
Just a bit. Just enough to keep us going. We got medicine, we got a bedroll, we got a table, and we got a stool. We are set. What are you doing? Smoothing the floor? Oh, you, you should probably work on growing first. That's under construct, I think. All right, you need to get back to work there, buddy. You are going to die if you don't get some food. Why are you smoothing the floor still? Ah, son of a... Oh. Nah, he just doesn't have the food now. This might kill us now. Because he went back to smooth the floor. This is supposed to be under construction. Not supposed to... This should take priority. Come on, Barracuda. Snap out of it. You just got to get this rice. It's right here. It's a really good start, too. We have a duster. Come on, Barracuda. Snap out of it, buddy. Okay, hold on here. Listen, you need to go right now. And probably try his cutting. Right now. Get some food. All right. Oh wait, that might have been undercut plants. All right, you need to consume the rice because you're still in a malnutrition. All right, he's got food. And this stuff is already anyway. Alright, drop it off and go to bed. Phew, okay. At least it was only a minor break. I can put the smooth order back on now. I do want to smooth the room because it'll make him his mood a lot better. I don't want him to be an unsightly environment. And uh, we should probably extend the home zone out then. Out to here. Actually out front, I think. Okay, we just need to get him to six so we can get wood. He's at six, okay. So we can pick, make a growing zone over here. That will be... Cactus. There we go. You gotta get away from these iguanas, they will eat the rice.
picking up news I want to steal in Barracuda's rice. She could deal with him, Barracuda. Any conflict has a possibility of death and infection, but we do have medicine. I don't think it's worth dealing with them just for that. And just all this out of here as fast as we can. All right, we are fairly set for food for a while. Go ahead and just put, fill this place up with food. It may not be cooked, but it is edible. Okay. Now we we'll start planting again and eventually get down to the saguaro trees. Oh shoot, I forgot. We also need to make um, spike traps. Uh, we should make one here and here. So just one there, I think. And yeah, maybe two. We're not really a jogger, so maybe one each would be good. And I think I want to do that right now. Because if we get attacked, he is not ready to face anybody in combat. He's still too young. He's 19 now. Still, but he's still just a young buck. He's just a young buck. Would like to get this stuff clean. All right, Barracuda. All right, he's fairly secure in food now. Ah, oh, wood. Okay, this is a big milestone for us. Getting wood up means that we do not have to fear the heat. Alright, what are his needs now? He's comfortable. The heat, he's still sleeping in the heat, but we're not we're not heat stroke yet. He's hungry. That'll be good in a minute. Unsightly environment will take care of that. That will also take care of awful bedroom. I think. Could put a pot of plant. Definitely don't have the wood for this. We're going to put a pot of plant up. Oh, I know also what we can do. We can build flower beds. Maybe not now, but we could have made flower beds. Your own people can trigger these, but they are worth having around because this is really my only defense. If I get attacked, I can circle around with this. I don't have Jogger, so it won't be fast. But I can get to the point where I can maneuver them around here and keep falling back. Now, eventually we're going to need to pick up somebody else. And that person is going to do our research. We 
We're also on the way to getting a stove now. And that's going to be really solid for us. Let's shrink the zone a bit. And go ahead and put in a stove. So we have access to some wood now. I would actually like to use that chair. Both. Yeah, that's what the reason why we need to do this is because of food poisoning. All right, so let's haul this. Go ahead and make a fuel stove here. That way we'll be able to use this chair for both. Yeah, this is a big problem. Because he can't keep anything down. If he breaks before he eats, we have big problems. Okay, cleaned all that up good. Okay. He's at least recovering from the food poisoning already. Food poisoning is nasty. Yep, ship to the stars. Understood. I'm not sure how we're going to get off the planet, but we will. I don't know how you relax socially if you're the only one there. There should be the... Maybe one more cactus here, I think. I take a long time to plant, but they're really good for his plant skills. He's at eight already. Okay. And we're building, we have a day lily growing in there. Okay. So here's our first raid. And that's fine because we have, we have it set up already. And now that we have wood, we can actually fuel the stove. And we can make sure that we have at least one simple meal all the time. So you have one. And cook will be a big priority here. Now we will not get food poisoning, most likely. As he gets better in cooking. Much less likely to get food poisoning now. Okay, and they're going to start their assault soon. Okay, so he's beginning his assault. That's okay. A little bit of time. Okay, now we want to take Barracuda out. And set him behind one of these traps. Move it a little bit. Come on, catch me, chase me. There you go. Not even hurt. And let's go ahead and make a brave. And he'll get a mood boost now. Because he killed somebody. <laughs> he witnessed the death. He didn't kill him, but he witnessed the death. All right, let's go ahead and put this over here for now. After he's done that, we'll let him finish his grave. Okay. 
And we want to get this body out there. Although he doesn't really matter for bodies. So I don't want to take people, especially from a 59 year old, who I don't know if they'll be a good match or not. We want to buy slaves if we can. All right. Place that trap. Put that knife away. And let's start smoothing stuff out again. Give himself a nice little living space. We will use this as a prison cell later. When we make our full base. But for now, for now, it's his room. Cooking level three, excellent. Let's just see the beauty overlay. Room stats. Beauty is negative 0.350, but that will increase soon. Barracuda. There we go, the beauty display. So these smooth tiles have negative two beauty. The ones on the ground have negative and positive two. Okay, the, the smooth ones have one beauty. Okay. Versus the negative two. So we get enough of this stuff. This is 20. Okay, we have visitors. And do they trade? They do not. That's okay. Okay, the next trader we have, we have food to trade away. Normally I would go for research here. But let's see his bio. We didn't get anything in intellectual, which kind of sucks. Should have been good to put one fire on there at least. But I'm kind of banking on getting another person. A request. That suits our bill. That's okay. We do need to make kind of a storehouse area, which we'll do now. So, building. So, we get a raid. And we like raids. Raids allow us to get gear.
Transport pod. Let's 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 see who it is. What is his bio? He's an archer. Low learner though. That's not what we want. I don't want to get over with two people right now. So anything? Do you have any gear on him? Off pants. Thirty-seven percent though. Be better. Setting fire to things we can't really allow that. He has an axe though. Oh, he needs to see us and then chase us. There we go. He should hit this trap here. Come on, Barak, out of the way. There we go. Okay. Uh, put out the fire. And we need to extend the home area out. And we get a manhunter pack right now. That's not good. Well, what we can do is... Um, all this stuff away. We just kind of sequester ourselves into. Oh, we got a visitor. That's good. Killer geese. Okay. Uh, I think we'll draft him and move him back. Okay. If he dies while we're here, we will lose faction. I don't want to actually use any of the medicine, but I guess we just did. That's okay. Let's strip this guy. He's got an axe, man. That is a steel axe. It might be poor, but it is still a steel axe. And I think he gets another, yeah, he gets killed somebody. Tying smoke leaf. Hilarious. Uh, we can actually trade. Yeah, I understand he's hurt, but we can steal the steel knife. And get herbal medicine. All we can get. Can we? I mean, it's all component off. I kind of need components. We need advanced components. I think this is fine for medicine. We do need to kind of keep the medicine under wraps. Okay, here's another raid. Means that I need to rebuild this now.
Cool. It's fully healed. Yes, he still he still has an awful bedroom in an ugly environment. Why is killing this environment? Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, the blood. Not bothered by the sight of it, but still. Alright, that should be better now, right? Okay, it's still just ugly, but it's not super terrible yet. Alright, Barracuda, you're up. Barracuda. Alright, come get me. Hey, like my field's on fire. Sure. Well, he's faster than me. That's not good. All right, we just have to kill him. Hope I don't die. You got two swipes on me, but I got an axe. Gotcha. Hey, 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 we need to finish this bitch off. Actually, let's see what, let's see what stats this. All right, again, we have the problem with this home area. Let's see what stats she has. Construction, eight. Pyromaniac, that's a no-go here. Let's strip her first. Guess you need to eat. This will take two seconds. I gotta strip her before she dies. I get that travel wear. It's on. We'll finish her off. Let me take out my stuff. Thinking. So this gives him a huge mood boost again. He doesn't care about bodies either. Oh, I am bleeding, huh? You can't bandage that with the frick. Apparently not. I lost my middle toe. That's not great. That means his movement's gonna be down a little bit. Actually, the middle toe is not bad. That's the the price you run with melee. Never gonna become famous like that. Here, go ahead and get you out of here, buddy. Take the band hammer. And we probably don't need all of this, so now this zone we can don't have to sew. Death is in 12 hours? What are you talking about, man? All right, I guess we do need a bandage for that. Okay. Had to use medicine on that. It sucks.
I need to make the storeroom now. Ouch. Yeah, the whole cooking area is dirty. Okay. So now this is the new stockpile zone. Okay. And this is not. And all this stuff. All out there. And this is not tainted. Neither is this. Another raid. Awesome. Super awesome. <clears throat> Still a little hurt from my last raid, but okay. And I have food poisoning, so I gotta use the traps. Still need treatment? What do you mean? Oh, shoot. Food poison. I hope he doesn't attack immediately. Well, things like this that can kill us. No, we're dead. And we're gone. Food poisoning. We die to food poisoning. I should have just gone inside and waited. Made a trap right here. See in the ball game. Barracuda. We'll try again tomorrow. All right, folks. That's it for today. I have failed. Thanks for joining me and have a good night. And I'll try again tomorrow. Peace out.